Hey, what's up guys? Check it out. Like I said before, uh, this is the 75 gallon tank that I'm gonna be setting up for a frog tank. And uh, I removed most of the plants, uh, pots that I had in here. And these are some of the plants that I'm gonna be using in the tank when I set it up. But I'm gonna, like I said before, uh, I'm gonna be going to a, a reptile show next month. And uh, I'm gonna be picking up some plants and checking out some frogs and stuff like that. And uh, this is, so this is the tank, 75 gallon. So I just gotta clean it out a little bit and, and then start setting things up. But I got a couple of things to uh, the other day. And I stopped by the Home Depot and I picked up this uh, waterfall foam sealant here that I'm gonna be using for the back, for the backdrop. And I picked up this uh, silicone here, 100% waterproof uh, silicone here, silicone one clear. And I got this, I had this piece of wood here, which I'm gonna also like attach to the back of the backdrop. And like I said before, I got the moss here. This, I think I'm gonna be using some Spanish moss also for the decoration, so I gotta pick that up. I, I'm gonna wait till the reptile show so I can see uh, what they have there. And when I stopped by the Home Depot, they had some air plants there for a buck that were on sale, so I picked up three of these. Three of these guys here, which I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna attach them to that piece of wood somehow. Uh, I think I'm gonna be using some type of glue. Just a little like maybe a drop just to hold it just to hold it there on the wood until the roots attach it onto the piece of wood or decorations that I'm going to be using. I laid out all of my uh, all of my um, plants here and it's, it's, maybe I take a clip in or two of, of these but I'm just gonna like I said I'm gonna wait till the uh, reptile show to see what they have there so I can put in that uh, frog tank that I'm gonna be using. A couple of days ago I caught this uh, jumping spider so I kept them I've been feeding them little flies and I have a mantis in here that I actually hatched from egg so so far I molted it like twice so it's getting bigger because I actually fed the other ones off to the frogs so I, I decided to keep uh, two of them from two different species. So this is the Chinese mantis here. See, it's getting big already. See, I have uh, eggs here that I hatch. I hatch them and then I uh, feed them to my frogs. Like I put two eggs at a time, but a lot of a lot of mantises come out and uh, I feed them to the frogs. I have another mantis here, which is much smaller. It's like right over here. Let me can see that. This mantis is a Carolina mantis. So I have one and one there. I'll keep them up here with my fruit flies. So that's it for this little update. Just a little quick video to let you know what's going on right now. And uh, I can't wait till that show comes and uh, I'm gonna be picking up a few things there and then actually start doing this, uh, this project with this uh, frog tank. I'm not sure what frogs I'm gonna put in yet, but I'll see. So guys, that's it. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys later on the next video. Peace out.